Hi everyone, welcome to my channel again haul videos a uh, lot of stuff I placed an order uh, while it was 20% uh, off on Sephora so I wanted to show you guys that stuff few things I added a little bit later like to just like for my giveaway or for more like fun stuff or those stuff which I wanted to try and few stuff I just got it like today and few stuff I bought it before it was 20% VIP uh, root sale. So this week it's more like a VIP sale and I didn't get that 20% off so I bought it on full price. Let's start again. I am starting this video around 10.30, not 11.30 but 10.30. Last video I started 11.30. So I'm, I'll try to go through things really fast but I, this time I want to make sure if there's few products which needs to swatch I'm gonna swatch those products so let's get started first thing as I told you like if you saw my last video or not but I mentioned that I placed an order for this Shiseido or uh, Shiseido facial cotton uh, and I heard that these are very good for using your toner so I'm really excited this is the first time I bought these ones so really excited this Bosha uh, refine balance to pour perfection so charcoal the secret to per perfectly pour less skin this I think cleanser only this is my favorite cleanser it's just like when you apply this warm on your face and you just feel like your pores are getting really clean and I really see a difference when I use this uh, cleanser so I wanted to order place an order for this and I saw this like whole set was $39 and I think only this uh, cleanser is like is around 30 plus maybe $36 that's why I was like with this whole thing it's such a good price then I got this Natasha Denona palette I don't know if you can see yes like this if you can see this Natasha Denona palette star palette the colors are actually written in the back over here the packaging is white which I was not even expecting because this is more like a fall palette and I was expecting the packaging is going to be like more colorful or goldenish silverish I don't know why but inside it's really beautiful it's like metallic and her name is over on the top Natasha Denona and this is like stars because it's a star palette and then here's the mirror and then you get these names over here also and this paper which I really appreciate this kind of plastic then you can secure your eyeshadows here's the palette very beautiful eyeshadows let me swatch few of those oh you know what this one is already broken I don't know if you can see that or no I'm just trying to press if it I can just make it work so this is a golden color this one I'm just uh, swatching a uh, few metallic eyeshadows because I heard really good things about these metallic the purpose of buying this palette was only to try her metallic eyeshadows because she's famous for her metallic eyeshadows so these are the four metallic eyeshadows very beautiful definitely it's worth still didn't feel like that it's like life-changing kind of uh, eyeshadows and why they are so costly um, I heard they are good quality and I can see the quality is good but $163 still don't think so it can justify it I just swatch it first time and if it's really soft you cannot really travel with these and let me just swatch a couple of more like the matte ones so yeah the matte ones are really pigmented if this palette is going to be worth only then I'm gonna keep it otherwise this is coming going back to Sephora coming back Sephora <laughs> no going back Sephora <laughs> in my last uh, haul video I showed two of uh, Bite Beauty Amuse Bouche lipstick duo and in this one I'm showing other two because these lipsticks are my favorite lipsticks to carry with me for the parties because in parties I just use like small clutches and there's no way I can carry a full size of lipstick 
the one I'm swatching the uh, jam and opal so jam is like this and opal is silverish this is not just like a party wear kind of lipsticks it's really convenient also even for your bigger purse I had like if I carry very heavy purse with me I've seen like my shoulders start hurting so here's the swatch of the jam and other side was opal and then this is like together if you want to create more like a metallic uh, look so this one is more like a, a sheen dual intensity kind of a lipstick it has white base with the blue and purple sheen which so if you apply it together to create more like a metallic so it's going to look like this I'm not very I don't know if I can wear this color or no but individually this color like it's a fall appropriate color jam other one is pepper and bronze I'm really excited about this, this one it's like a metallic bronze yeah and and this one is pepper and these lipsticks are not bad you see how much you are getting I'm still using my last year ones and it's still in my purse and I don't think so even I've used half of that so this one is pepper this one is bronze I don't know if you can see that or no so it's like a metallic kind of thing when you mix it together this is the color you create so pepper and uh, bronze together I'm fine like for the touch-ups I don't mind but I don't think so I can use this uh, the metallic top coat uh, of this lipstick so jam is fine but opal is like mm. and I'm gonna show you jam is this color perfect berry fall color I didn't show you I know and see while I was trying opal the berry sh actually transformed on this so this is like a white with blue hint and uh, uh, mauve hint into this tartiest lip paint in color bestie so this one is like limited edition for this like fall here's the one it's a very like nude beige nude color I got one more bite beauty lipstick multi stick in color gelato actually I just feel these lipsticks are the bomb um, like again it's like magnetic you can use this as your lipstick your cheek color your eye color you can use these multi sticks uh, so that's why I like it's like so versatile here's the gelato and this is what I'm wearing on my lips now if you can see yes now you can see it's a very pretty mauve pinkish color few stuff I got it from Nordstrom Macy's also few stuff so it's not just like Sephora wanted to just show you whatever I got like recently so I'm just uh, mixing all the stuff together so then I got this Bobbi Brown touch-up brush it's like a flat shader brush bobby brown sh shimmer sparkles or nars shimmers eyeshadows like like urban decay makes like moon dust eyeshadows those kind of uh, glittery eyeshadows and i was looking for a perfect brush even i got the mac 242 brush but then uh, the bobby, bobby brown the lady was telling me this brush is really good for those kind of uh, eyeshadows sparkly ones so I got this one so again it's Bobbi Brown touch-up brush and I got this nail polish by um, Formula X I really love their nail polishes but I just want to tell you like Formula X nail polishes has only one drawback if you don't use base coat with that your nails are going to be literally yellow yellow means yellow and even if you use a base coat your nails are going to be a little bit yellow not as much but still so you have to always make sure you apply a really good base coat which can protect your nails from uh, from you get it 
uh, so again it's like a dual intensity metallic with glitters so then I got Bobbi Brown this uh, brush angled face brush so you can use it for your blush bronzer or for applying all over uh, powder I'm gonna tell you uh, in some video when I'm gonna use these brushes is this really worth the price because these are like $38 something $40 $48 something like really pricey brushes this one alone is like $28 brush so yep and then one more limited edition lipstick is Alison by Anastasia 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 Beverly Hills lipstick it's like a little bit darker and it has more like a brownish tinge very beautiful again Alison so for me it's more like a dark mauve no brown with the hint of mauve tone one more brush by Bobbi Brown and it's full coverage face so it's basically a brush for like all over uh, powder brush Estee Edit Coal Shadow Stick oh I love this color it is a zero to frost bite yes sometimes I just see the word and I just assume so like I just saw this bite otherwise I could just say bright and so, like I don't know if that is my problem or everyone is like that just like if I see half word I just assume this is going to be the word uh, so instead of bite I could say bright maybe it's frost bright and then I would like no it's not bright it's frost bite I really just like jump into conclusions really fast I don't know so the packaging everyone knows about these uh, Estee Edit it's a very unique green color like a light greenish color actually more like a uh, very metallic metallic golden goldenish but hint of green in it really pretty I hope you could see it definitely it's so unique then I got this uh, Estee Edit Inside Track Eye Kajal so this is like a blue and light blue one like this side is dark blue and this one side is light blue so here's the swatch this is light blue this is navy blue royal blue navy blue actually it's not royal blue it's not navy blue it's more like a peacock color yes so it's a peacock color it's very beautiful I thought it's more like a navy blue zero one black gunmetal and I already got the green one also which is going to be maybe in my next haul video so it looks like this this is more like a black see this one is gunmetal this one is black gunmetal black I'm really excited about this product I want to share with you because this is the product it's not for me it's for you guys so I got this Sephora favorite uh, so you're getting beauty blender full size Becca cosmetics it's not full size benefit cover effects enhanced click in bubbly is in full size Estee Edit shadow stick 01 black wiper is in full uh, full size Foreo Luna play in fuchsia color uh, it's uh, like a mini 100 uses one glam glow super mud small size Cat Von D tattoo liner in trooper it's full size Laura Mercier travel size translucent loose setting powder and plus puff also radiant creamy concealer in custard and tart marine boosting 4-in-1 mist urban decay wise lipstick 714 it's like a red color one and this set is coming to I don't know who but this is not the video I'm declaring this Sephora favorites uh, for my giveaway next video is going to be a huge big giveaway and that is going to be the next one so I'm collecting all the stuff now and half of the stuff is ready for the giveaway but there is still a lot of stuff which I have to like get together and I'm not thinking of getting 
two winners or three winners i might do six winners in my giveaway so i'm doing different different kind of like gift cards and then beauty products for different it's going to be a different kind of giveaway i have three giveaways are go going on right now on my channel i'm going to leave all those three giveaways in the description box and then you can check it if you are you didn't apply for my giveaway you can apply nothing you have to do you have to be just my subscriber my twitter follower and my instagram follower uh if you want to leave a comment for just adding one entry it's up to you and other thing i just want to say sorry i'm getting lot of messages lot of comments that's what i wanted like i wanted to get some kind of communication with you guys then i just wanted to know to do something to just do a better job i'm getting lot of good response thank you so much but if you have any advice i would love to have that also i am really busy right now really really busy i really cannot tell you how my life is running right now so really didn't have time to to sit and respond to those messages that's why i'm just saying that thank you so much don't think that i'm not reading it but right now i just want to say thank you thank you and thank <laughs> more than that i really for these things you cannot say enough thank you because uh, you your comments are changing my energy level to work for my youtube channel so thank you again for this video everything is done and i'll see you on my next video till then bye